Hello, Wolfric. No. Oh, no. Bye, Divine. I have to pay respect. Dap a rip if you can. Nalia says hi to Siri. Oh, How's your ferret doing, Aggie? Um, still doing... Well, we're getting a little low on wood, so I should probably have some of my gatherers helping out with that. In fact, I've got... Everyone can do a little bit of gathering. Why are they not helping? There we go. Right, how much elven wood? 48 elven wood. A little bit more, I think. I can then build the well. It does not want me to come do. out this way. It really doesn't. Every time I come out this way, it there's horrible things happen to me. It's surprising, honestly. It does surprise me. Oh, you got a, Ooh, a, a child has grown up. Hooray! This is not an easy place to grow up in, but alas, grow up we must. One of your children has matured into a young adult and is ready to join your village and rebuild Thea. I think I want a warrior because I've got tons of everything else. Hooray! The child killed a mouse with its bare little hands. Looks like a promising warrior. Or a promising little psychopath. <laughs> Depending on which yes. way you want to look at it. Celebrate the rite of passage. I knew one of those kids would grow up eventually. You're welcome, Al Young. Ooh. A figure clad in a ragged, dark green cloak slowly approaches your party. As he gets closer, it's clear he is barefoot. Uh, barefooted and carries nothing more than the clothes on his back. Th this is the event that you had before. Seeing your party, the figure takes off the hood to reveal a gaunt, oh, tired elf. face of an elf. With his blackened, sad eyes looking straight through the souls of your men. Despite the evident sick... Uh, sickliness, there remains an air of grace, a whisper of bygone beauty in the forgotten ancient creature. He stretches his arms before you in a gesture of peace, but does not speak. Uh, try to talk to the elf. You approach the wanderer, mimicking the sign of peace. You speak up. This is a dangerous road to be roaming on your own, sir. Are you alright? There is no reply from the figure, and so your men make another attempt. As they get closer, the elf steps back and waves at them to stay away. Um, do you need any help? You seem sickly. The elf shakes his head in response and bows slightly to say thank you. He starts moving again, but you see that his pace is very slow, as if every step is a measured effort. Uh, looks really weak. Give the stranger some basic supplies. Uh, I gave him two bigos and one fruit pie. And I got pretty much the same uh, result as you. Yeah. Blessing of attractiveness. We just don't have quite, quite enough folklore and things like that. Yeah. I just didn't have quite enough physical for the orc one. Yeah, I really need to uh, bump that up. But just to uh, finish the story, the elf seems uneasy when you approach with the supplies, but when you place the small bag before him, he musters up a smile and bows us more in thanks. He takes the bag and closes his eyes, making a hand gesture towards the skies, the earth, and then the ground. You recognize this as a symbol for the cosmic tree. The figure moves away from the party, his steps clearly made lighter by the kindness of your men, and some of you feel a strange energy run through your veins. There we go. All right, continue your journey. Nothing much more to do there. Right, I'm up past 50 elven wood. I think one or two, well, one more turn, then we'll head back to the base. Is that, remember when I made the decision to nearly kill every single elf in the land, Avak? Ah, good times. Is that, he's very close to his or fortress roots. Did we get any children? No. Right, the lumberjacks can head back and drop off some of their spoils. Also, possibly pick up one of the other people here. Um, oh, finally, someone that can actually carry armor. Yes. I'm going to bring Mislidar. You know what? I haven't named Mislidar yet. My lord. But uh, I will be bringing them with me. Let me drop off all of this. There we go. Don't need any of it. Roll go in there. The child can go in there too. So can the fruit. Don't need the fruit. Don't want the fruit. Kind of want the fruit to be turned into food. There we are. Good. Uh, but now I need to rename uh, Mislida. And it's so close to Isda that I'm not going to do it. It's going to be Pigman King. <laughs> 
There we go, Pigman King. You have been named. How? Oh, right, okay. I want to possibly build the watchtower. Let me just check the village overview. I've got a herbless hut. I've got several cabbage patch. I've got a pasture. Yeah, I wouldn't mind getting me a watchtower of elven wood make. That would give me an attract elf of one and a vision of two. I mean, it's not a good vision. That's the only thing. And it's kind of a big thing. It's not a good vision at all. Make it out of bone instead, maybe. Um... I'm finding that. I'm making things, but it's just not... They're not great, you know? You think, oh, I'm yeah. going to have these new materials. They're going to be so good. I can... I mean, a plus one to Elven Attraction is nice. I'll go for it. Also, this will give me 22... Um, 22 research, so, you know, it's certainly not a bad thing. Uh, let's get you gathering, please. Go ahead, gather that. There we are. As for crafting, I can now make shields. And I can make... There we are. I could make the dewdrop shield out of elven wood and fur leather. Four armor, five shielding, three attractiveness, and one dexterity. It's a fairly nice shield. Or three armor, five shielding, three attractiveness if I use dark wood. Um... Okay, I just renamed um, Theska to be Garrett. Okay. A basic buckler. Oh, four armor, seven shielding. A monster shell. Five armor, seven shielding, one dexterity. That one's really nice. If I have monster bone and fur leather, that makes a pretty good shield, all things oh, told. Cool. Unfortunately, I, I don't have monster bone as a resource that I get, but That's it a weighs 112, you bone, don't you? you don't get monster bone. Yeah. Whereas if I make dew drop just out of wood, elven wood is crazy light. And hide is... Oh, actually. I can use any leather. That's really quite good. Hmm. Um Yeah, I think I think I'll do that. I'll I've got enough uh if I don't make the watchtower I'd have enough. But I really want the watchtower. So I'll go out and get some more elmwood, but I'm gonna make a bunch of dewdrop shields. They're fairly light, give good shielding, armor, attractiveness, and dexterity. Very good. I think that'll actually be a pretty pretty nice one to set up for me. So sure. Let's get that being made. I'll just make one for now. It's all I can make. Have a right, look there at we my go. Jewelry and stuff. Okay. I don't have much to make um, the jewelry with, so. Mm, yeah, it'll take a little bit of time to get it all together. I need plus ten ferret attraction, apparently, according to Arkham. I don't need more ferrets. I'm happy with the ones I've got. If I pet my ferrets enough, do they pancake? Um, well, currently they're trying to eat their food bowl. I'll be right back. Oh no, triple headed ferret. Come then. Right, well, I'm You're at the moment trying to make now, some but... jewelry. Oh, scamps. Okay. They're dancing around on the couch behind me. <laughs> see, I told you they dance. Now everyone can see. 
water. There's a bit of a delay, but I'm, I'm looking to see if they... No, they all just jumped off. They didn't dance. No, no, they, 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 they will. Mm -hmm. You just keep oh, watching. Oh, there you go, there you go. Yeah. Ah. Right. I shall wait for you to end your turn once you're ready. Okay, yeah, I just set up some more jewellery. Okay. Just gonna set Renard to make it. End turn. Hooray! Alright. Oh, I'm gonna need a little bit more album wood. I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to go back and get some more, but um, it'll be worth it. I promise. Um, go there. Alright, go there. I'm gonna stack them up. I well, I guess I kinda do need a little bit more wood actually. Sure. There we go. I wish I wish I had a, a better camera for this sort of thing. I've just got a basic webcam. I mean it's a good webcam, it's a high quality webcam, but it's just you know a regular webcam. I wish I had a, a proper little camera or like a tripod mm. thing that I could move around because they're just dancing around the room right now and they look so funny when they dance. Because they it's just kind of open their mouth dancing. and just like ah as they they're backing up and <laughs> they're not steering at all. They just look like they hey, it's so hard to describe, but they look like they're just so full of joy. It's infectious. There we go, I'll just uh, wrap that turn up. You can kind of hear um, Siri duking around. Ugh, now there's a big two skull fight in right between me and the stuff I want. Do you have many fighters in that group? Because you've got seven people in Neoland Light. I, I know, because strongly... since I sent this party out, I've had more people join the the village, mm. so, and I lost a person out of the expedition group. But every time I send an expedition group out to get this nimble wood, I have to send them back again. Sorry, Midna was trying to uh, stash my foot. Um, and this terrain, you can't move very fast on it. Yeah, that's the problem with that terrain. Do you have many different types of food? Because that would give you extra movement. Um... Inventories. Uh, got one, two, three different no, you've types got, of you've food. No, you've only got you've only got eight days worth of food on you as well. You got sixty-three uh, days worth of wood back. though. Yeah, I'm gonna. Need you to should come never back. really have that much days worth of wood because wood is heavy. You never want to have that much wood. No. Yeah, I'll have to go back. I hope they won't jump on me or anything. I'm sure they won't. Oh, thank you very much, MD72. Stream tip takeover commence. Oh, the, the tip train. I'm not sure. Tip train's jeans been in the station for a long while. I, I don't don't know if the conductor knows how to use it anymore. Um, Right, well, we've got a shield made. Let me see if there's any warriors who would like it. I mean, it's a little bit less shielding. One point less shielding, but three extra attractiveness. And, you know, that's going to count. It'll be good. <laughs> MD72. One pound. Stream chip takeover part two. Thank you. <laughs> oh, bless you. Uh, right. Uh, again, some more Elmwood. I'm just going to keep passing turns for a little bit. Thank you very much, Elijah Bailey, for the resub. 11 months in a row. Can we get some love in chat for Elijah Bailey, please? Maybe a cup of tea, some biscuits. If someone could bring Bailey, me some tea that? and biscuits, that would be really great. Yeah, back. What is Siri doing? I must know. I've got one of these uh, plug in air fresheners. All right. And so he was trying to to eat the top of it. Well, I fancy that when it, it just maybe went with some uh, uh, some of the fragrance. And so he was very interested in how to get into the perfume. Oh. That is information I don't want you learning. 
Come on. You want to come back up? Or you just want to lick my hand? That's okay. Right. Oh, you do want to come back up. No, you don't. Uh, I think she does. She's probably going to just keep jumping on my lap this is, now. This is now the Siri stream. Yes, this is the Siri stream. I'm sure... Sorry, everyone in YouTube land. Where is this she... like... My God, they're not playing the game. They're just talking about ferrets. This is what my life is like sometimes. See, is she wanting to get on onto you, or is there something on your desk she wants? Um, she may want to get onto my desk. I don't know. Uh, yep, there she is. Hello, say hello again. Hello, hello, hello. Mwah, goodbye. Boink. Thank you very much, MD72, for stream tip takeover part three. I won't stop. <laughs> oh, eventually, you'll run out of money. Eventually, I'll start feeling so guilty. I'll, I'll just uh, delete my PayPal or something. Uh, yep, still getting some more album wood. Being boring at the moment. I'm being very boring because I'm just okay. like walking Another across turn the terrain. Well. One more turn back in the village. Next time she climbs up, I will let her kiss the camera if you really want to Ockham. But I'm not going to wipe the camera afterwards, so you know, be careful what you wish for. <laughs> The rest of the rest of the stream's webcam will just have this weird streak down the middle. Yeah, I'm thinking we need to go for about another half hour, and then I'm going to be too hungry to carry on. Oh, MC Twenty Seven, stream to take over part four until it's all mine. Slowly trying to replace all of the names on the latest tips. You cunning swine! I see. I only just worked out what he was doing. I am perhaps a little bit too slow or new to this whole tip of malarkey. Uh, right, let's transfer all of that across. And new exposition. Things. There we go. Right then, let me have a look. What do I want to go and gather? Also, I kind of want to go around. What be this? Herbalist hat. Don't really need to do that. I'm going to go and check out the place of interest, actually. Uh, yeah, I think this group is powerful enough to do that. I may find out very soon if they're not. Um, and I would like to make a lot of those shields. So let's stack all of this up. We are, each time I make one of these shields is with seven research. Or maybe that goes down with the amount that I make. I'm not sure, but uh, I'm very happy to I'm just making it. my expedition at the moment in case you wonder why I'm a little bit quiet. No, that's fine. Uh, I've got the watchtower in one turn. There we go. MD27. Stream takeover part 5. Hi YouTube, sorry for all the annoying tips. I'm sure they don't mind. I don't think the, uh, the tip sounds are that loud when it comes through on YouTube. Hello, Chris Nixter. Welcome to the stream, mate. And hello, the Devinies. Divine. Divine. Oh, I'm just. See, Divine. I'm so sorry. I've just I've just worked out what your name is. I'm I'm so innocent. I I'm no perhaps I. Divine, your character him. died. I'm really sorry. Siri's having a great deal of fun. She's just climbed into her toy bag. And yes. is now just basically rolling around in all of the toys. If you're wondering what if that is. If I was that small and I had is. like a toy bag that was like bigger than me, I'd probably roll around in it too. Fair point. I'd do the same. Can't even mm -hmm. pretend I wouldn't. Okay, just looking over the expedition. Oh, I hadn't put any wood into it, so that would be handy. I will do my best, Foxmaster, to name a character after you. If you happen to be talking when I next need to name a character and I notice it. How's your turn going, Sheila? I am just trying to reduce weight a little bit. I've taken some heavy foods. Mm, have you not got basic foods? Um, sorry, cooked foods, rather. 
I've got a few different things. I'm trying to just get as many foods as I can. I've got two, four, six, seven different types. Mm, I don't okay. know how many different types I need. Uh, five different types to get the extra food. One movement. If you want extra two movement, you need ten different types. Oh, I'll put the meat back then so that it's not weighing You can down. always swing by a Vakis where I've got stupid amounts of food. Of different, different types. Different types, okay. Like a Vacus itself could have two extra movement if it wanted. I will, I will come down and grab food off you then. Yeah, sure. I've got fifty turns worth of food and thirty-two turns worth of wood, so that's fine. Hooray! There we go. I've expanded my uh, vision to from. The, the water's edge to the water's edge. Oh, Isn't brilliant. Isn't too terribly bad. I'll, I might swap that watchtower at some later date for something much better. I mean, the Elven attraction is nice, but, 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 it's not really that useful on watchtower because I'm only getting one Elven attraction. Yeah, you want to be really quite selective about your buildings because you can't have yeah. that many. Yeah, exactly. Right, there we go. I will be off toward the place of interest. I'm going to just hear the ferret scampering around behind me. I always wonder, what are you up to? <laughs> no good, no doubt. <laughs> Indeed. Right, I've got another shield there. That is fantastic. Um, you can have this one. It's actually lighter and Better in every way than the one you've got. Excellent. It's always nice when it's a flat upgrade. I'm not sacrificing one thing for something else. Right, I've got a point of research. Question is, what do I want to spend it on? I need another 10... Um, no, sorry, another 12 points before I get my next point of research. Hmm... Could go for the well and then the manger. I could go for the smithy. The well looks good because you get like random stuff each yeah. time, and you might you can get end up getting rare. very good stuff. Yeah. But at the same time, I f I kind of feel like I need to expand out my resources a bit more, honestly. Yeah, it's just like so precious a resource at the uh, research point. <laughs> MD twenty seven stream tip take over. Last time people stopped me. Hehe. <laughs> Well, no one stopped me this time. <laughs> You're a very kind soul, mm. MD72. I said 27 before. It's late. I'm hungry. I'm going to put it down to that. Also, I'm going to go for Monster Bone because I know I can make pretty good shields out of Monster Bone and Elven Wood. Oh, can you actually get Monster Bone to... I didn't realize you could as actually dig it up as a resource. That's yeah. cool. Yeah, and you can get Enchanted Bone, in fact. Dragon Bone would take three research points from this point. Wow. Uh oh, Siri's trying to take apart the house. Ah, uh, you know you're in trouble. Yes, you know that. Come on. I'm guessing Siri's in trouble. Yes. Going back to her cage. Wow, she's really in trouble. She was scratching at the door. Uh, so we've uh, put her and Midna back in the cage. Because Midna was looking a little bit tired anyway. Right. Ah, all the monster bone has to be so far away, doesn't it? That's annoying. It's not near anything else I really want to go in. Oh, well, actually, the monster bone is near some of the dryad wood. Up near the refugee camp. I guess that's not too bad. All things considered, mm. it's not too terrible. Yeah, that's, that's what seems to be everything up by that area, to be honest. Yeah, pretty much. Except the nimble wood that I'm trying to get. 